Good afternoon, good morning, good evening, good whatever time of day, maybe for you ladies and gentlemen. I'm the Layback Gamer, and we are here with a tutorial on how to install StarCraft Mass Recall, as I was uh, asked how to do so in a comment. Sorry about not getting this out over the weekend, but I guess the saying better late than never doesn't really apply. Anyways, so you first want, first thing you need to do is come over to www sc2mapster.com or you can just type in starcraft mass recall installer and look for that link there i'll see if i can leave a link in the description for where to go but importantly you need at least a minimum of three files in order to install and i i opted for all five for five files as the extra bits add on some extra stuff so you need map and mod assets as well as one of the different local localization languages if you don't see it in here then i don't think i do not believe that the language is supported here possible that it might be but anyways if you want uh, to see the starcraft 2 remastered cinema packs pick one of these and then if you want the bonus in Slaver's Campaign, you pick one of these. So I have all five of them still downloaded from when I had originally tried to do this. I really should delete them because that is a lot of space. These, uh, these are pretty chunky files. Anyways, you want to export them, or sorry, extract them. And I labeled a file uncompressed just to showcase that off. First thing you want to do is we're going to open this file up. Now you see a mods folder. You want to click, you want to drag, hold that, and bring it into here. Or you can create your own mods folder and drag the two, drag those into there. Um, mine's pretty empty because I've only been using it for mass recall, but in the future there might be, I might have some more populated in there. Anyways, uh, the other thing you need to do is take this and drag it into your maps folder. See, I got this in here. Just need to drag, click, sorry, click, drag, drag it right into there, and you should be all good. This will contain the first six campaigns here, as you can see, the exact same. Next, we're going to, we may as well go, we'll work our way back to the top of the list here. We have the Enslavers campaign, and what you want to do with this is you want to go all the way in until you see Enslavers Redux. Click, drag, and move it into the extras folder here. As you can see, I already have a copy of, in, of this here. This should already come with Loomings and the Stukov series, so there's no need to, to put those in there. And that's everything that we're going to need in the Maps folder. The rest of this is going to be in Mods. And if we go over to Assets, as you can see, Mods folder, you want to put this into the Mods here. And Cinematics, again, Mods, drag into there. And local mods, nope, I want to open it up. Local or mod folder, drag it into there. Very simple, fairly easy. Once you've done that, uh, you can either or choose to start it up through this. I believe this is the one that we need. Nope, hold on. Nope, I did a slight boo boo there. Uh, don't open it up using that, because then you have to open the file, but we will need to open it up. Instead, go into mods, nope, go into maps, this, launch this here. And just give it a second, it'll take a minute to load up. You do want to go into the editor, it'll bring this up. This is how I normally get into it. I think there was another way, but I didn't quite get that to work, so unfortunately, now well, unfortunate for me, but this is just as good. And all you need to do to run Mass Recall is hit the SC2 button at the top. Click that, it'll take a little bit, and eventually we'll open your Star open up your StarCraft 2. So yeah, that is the that is a brief tutorial on how to make that work. I guess we can uh hit the start button. Uh the screen might go black for a second here while we wait for it to load up. But by clicking that button, as you can see. I don't care about that outplay. Go away. Oh, uh, because <laughs> I clicked off of there. Anyways, 
As you can see, StarCraft Mass Recall is now loading up. And that's basically everything from there. Basically, well, all you need to do. It still takes your uh, sound settings and whatever you got for, uh, for your StarCraft. So you go up to your options. I don't want to go in there just in case uh, it has any personal info. Yeah, you can come down to your options here to customize your thing, to customize this. Uh, I think most of this is already set to what it is. We go to Evolution Chamber. I think some of these are turned off. Uh, authorize the use of side emitter. I think this is turned off by default, and this enables the uh, Nightmare or Endgame difficulty, which we'll, we are playing on currently. As well as we got your extra hero abilities, appearances, uh, banter, installation maps in third person, which is just for episode four of mission one and episode five of mission of episodes. Oops, I did that the wrong way. Mission four of episode one and mission five of episode two. It's only the two there. We will get to, uh, I think, in the no, uh, two more episodes, maybe three more from when I this out we will be on that mission so yeah um the other thing models oh yeah i forgot i could do all brood war stuff here i forgot about that i definitely want to turn that on so starting from here we're going to have all brood war stuff which should be very nice very nice or i can do all starcraft too or if you want you can mix and match so for instance if i say want the goliath the Marine, Medic, Fire, Ghost, they'll all go to StarCraft 1, and then the rest will stay at StarCraft 2. Uh, we'll go ahead and go these two. Yeah, so we'll keep these ones, and when we play the next mission, you guys will be able to see that. Uh, actually, we'll also go uh, Bunker as well. Why not? And this will switch it over to the, Star the StarCraft 1 skins. So... Uh, lastly, extras, Matt, that button will take you to the Loomings campaign, Stukov series, and Enslavers. How this goes in terms of order is Loomings is first, then you go through your main campaign, the other campaigns next. Stukov, and then Enslavers. That's the, uh, order that you play them in. Anyways, uh, I think that's enough of a tutorial. Thank you for tuning in. I hope to whoever was asking that question, uh, let me... Let me go see who it is there. Pardon me for just one moment while I take a quick look. Uh, let's see here. It was on Backwater Station. Uh, Elboy-8089. I hope this was good enough for you to be able to understand how to load it up. And if you got any more questions, I'd be feel free to answer it. Anyways, I'm the Layback Gamer. And until next time, take it easy.